Hi, I'm Sarah, and I'm an educator at the Zoological Society of Milwaukee. Today, we're going to go on a scavenger hunt outside and see if we can find some interesting, cool animals. I live in an apartment, so I don't really have a backyard, so instead, I'm going to be walking around my neighborhood. I live near Lake Michigan, so some of the animals that I'll see today might be a little different from the animals that you'll see in your backyard. While we're outside, make sure that you have your observation goggles on, your listening ears, and you stay a safe distance away from animals. Today, I decided to go for a walk to the Lakeshore State Park. I love listening to the waves and songbirds, and it's a great place when it's nice and warm. First animals I saw while I was on my walk were geese. I saw two parents and six babies. Fun fact, a group of geese is called a gaggle. There were a lot of birds on my walk, but one that really caught my eye was the tree swallow. They have a beautiful blue-black back and a white chest. If you need help identifying a bird, go online to the Cornell Lab and use their bird guide. I also saw some bumblebees. I wasn't close enough to get a video of them, but I did get close enough to what they were eating. Dandelions! It's a very important food source for them in the springtime. I've also seen a lot of these red-winged blackbirds while I've been walking in the spring. They are so much fun to watch, and I love how this one just hops on down from its little post. We can't forget about the spiders. This spider web was glistening in the sun as I passed by. I was so excited when I saw this rabbit. Some fun facts, rabbit teeth don't stop growing as they get older and they can jump as high as three feet in the air. Okay, this is a hard one. Can you see an animal in this photo? It's an American goldfinch. You would never guess by its bright yellow coloring that it would be good at camouflaging or hiding but it did a pretty good job here. The last thing I found on my adventure walk were these little swirly things attached to vines. Those are actually roots. Thank you so much for joining me on my adventure today. If you've seen any cool animals today or in the past couple weeks, leave a comment below. Have a great day.